What's up guys, we're back with another epic video and they have finally announced the date for the Platinum Blue Eyes. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, a few months ago, Konami announced that they were going to be selling a silver Blue Eyes White Dragon. I think it's like made out of platinum or some sort of metal, maybe even silver. I don't know what it's made out of. We're about to look at the actual announcement in a second. It's gonna cost $1,000. $1,000 if you think about Yu-Gi-Oh cards in general, it's not like the craziest price, but for it to be coming from Konami at $1,000, like they are selling it for $1,000 is wild. Like it's, it's wacky. It's something we've never seen. So limited to a thousand, pretty cool, and a thousand dollars. So it's a pretty crazy thing. They kind of said, well, we're gonna tell you when when it's gonna go for sale soon. And we've just been waiting. And now they finally announced it. This video was brought to you by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online community with thousands of classes. And it's also less than $10 a month with an annual subscription. Skillshare provides a multitude of different classes. So whatever your interests are, you can find them on Skillshare. The different categories of classes include animation, creative writing, film and video, fine art, graphic design, illustration, music, photography, design, and web development. One class that has interests me is a class regarding graphic design and how to create logos. I admit, I have a lot of room to improve. One class I'm taking is Graphic Design for Beginners by Derek Mitchell, so I can learn how to make logos for my YouTube channel. And if you guys want a chance to check it out for free, make sure you click the link below because the first 1,000 of you get a free trial of the premium membership. Take the chance, it's free, and see if you guys can find a class that you will love. Back to the video. Check out this tweet I saw on Twitter. I'm at Ruxin34 on Twitter. If you guys wanna go follow me there, I'm gonna be tweeting all kinds of stuff about this. And then of course, I'm always tweeting you guys and all that kind of stuff. So give me a follow there. Shameless plug, let's get into it. The Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG Twitter account tweeted, Attention duelists, get ready. The highly coveted Platinum Blue Eyes White Dragon will be available for pre-order on June 14th, just one week from today. So I'm recording this on June 7th, so it's obviously, obviously today is a week from the 14th. You guys will see this on the 8th probably. Um, but yeah, so six days from when you see the video, this thing is gonna be on pre-order. Be sure to check back for a pre-order link. So I'm still not sure how you pre-ordered. I guess they will tweet it out or something. I don't know, they said check back and they're tweeting it. So do they mean it's on Twitter? What is the deal here? Then they have a picture of it. So here, if you guys look at this, it says Yu-Gi-Oh! Trading Card Game Masterpiece Series. That's kind of cool sounding. So it's a series. I don't know what else we're gonna get. Probably Dark Magician at some point. Platinum Blue Eyes White Dragon. It's inside this glass like display. It looks really cool. It looks like a prize card or something. Available for pre-order on the 14th. Now, there's a couple things I wanted to talk about besides the fact that it's been announced. It can now be sold at 1,000. I kind of want to talk about, is it worth buying for $1,000? So if you're thinking about Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards are usually not limited to a certain number. The prize cards for Yu-Gi-Oh were like a hundred or less for the SJC ones. For most of them, they were pretty low, you know, population overall, just in general. But after that, like stuff like 10K Dragon, people thought 10K Dragon was 10,000 copies and they went crazy for it. This one's only supposed to be a thousand, but there's a little, there's a little hitch. So let's go back and read the original announcement. I want you guys to see this. On the Yu-Gi-Oh card.com site, where they first announced it, I believe, you go to the page that's under the products, you got the Masterpiece Series, all that stuff. Yu-Gi-Oh TCG Masterpiece Series, product type other, launch date 614, so they've added that recently. Summer 2021, MSRP 1,000 per card. So let's get into the little uh, description here. In 2021, a small number of duelists will be celebrating in style. A small number, 1,000, pretty small. Celebrating in style with our new card. A special all metal blue eyes white dragon. It's it's metal, that's crazy, it's awesome. Limited 1,000 initial copies. This is what I want you guys to see. Not 1,000 copies, 1,000 initial copies. Please keep this in mind, guys. What does initial copies mean? We'll get back to that in a second. Duelists in North and South America will be able in spring. Only North and South America? I did not notice that. Wow, so you can only order this from North and South America. So I don't I don't know what the, that's kind of weird. So I bet that this will be a hot commodity for people overseas. Like maybe uh, Japan would love their 10K Dragon. So I bet people from Japan will be interested in this as well. In spring, to order this exclusive collectible directly from us online. So online, we're gonna be able to order it. Made of 99% pure silver, burnished to a platinum colored finish, and encased in a protective brick of acrylic at $1,000 each. These cards are not for everyone, obviously. So if you don't have $1,000, you don't have to worry about it, but it is fun to follow, you know, what happens with it. Orders will be limited to one per customer. Obviously, it'd be insane because people could buy them out. They could, you know, 
relist a relist them on eBay for 10k or whatever. I'm sure people are going to do this anyway. They're going to buy it and they're going to want to flip it immediately for more money. And I figured that that probably will happen. Even at $1,000, I think this thing will sell out pretty quick at a short 1,000 copies. The scary thing though, we have to go back to that that word, the initial copies. Limited to 1,000 initial copies. What does that mean, guys? That means Konami says, you know what? We sold a thousand of these for a thousand bucks like that. Let's make some more of them. And if they do that, the first 1,000 are no longer as valuable as they once were because they just print more. Unless they have numbers on them, which I highly doubt. We've never seen this in Yu-Gi-Oh! But if they're numbered one through a thousand or something like that, then you can differentiate the originals from the reprint that they have, which may or may not happen. I doubt that happens. So be very aware before you spend $1,000 on this card that it's not a guaranteed one in a thousand. They could go from one in a thousand to one in 10,000. What if they make 9,000 more? What if, they probably won't sell 10,000 and a thousand, but maybe they will. This is very important to keep in mind, guys. If you're gonna spend this much money on a card, be aware that they may reprint it. And also it's not even a regular card. You know, it's like a silver, it's like a special card. So I don't know if the demand will be higher or will be lower for this. I think it's going to have some pretty good demand because it is a special event. We've never seen something like this from Konami. So it is really, really cool. Like, honestly, I'm thinking about buying one. I just don't know. Honestly, that initial copies really scares me, you know, because if I buy something for a thousand dollars at that point, it's an investment. Buying a card at MSRP for a thousand. It's not like you graded a card and it became a thousand. This card's starting off one thousand dollars. So it's pretty scary. Um, but I thought this was pretty interesting. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this. Are you guys scared of that initial word? Are you guys scared of the initial 1,000 copies? What do you guys think about the card itself? You know, all metal. What do you think about 1,000 MSRP? Do you think it's fair that they're taking a little bit more of the profit for themselves? I personally, I understand it because they know they have collectible cards and all that stuff and they want to give something special and collectible to people. What I would like for them to do though, is not put that initial in there. I would like, if they're gonna sell something for a thousand, guarantee us that number, give us that, okay, it's gonna be 1,000 for sure. We will sell you 1,000, we're gonna put it at a higher price because we know it's very valuable, very collectible. But when you put initial, you kind of put everyone's purchase at risk. And it makes it a little bit scary for people to buy. And it, it's like, do we trust them to not do it? Or are they gonna print more on us, you know, just to make more money? which they're a company that's got to make money. I understand all that stuff. Everybody's got to make some money to, you know, to live, whatever. But I, I, I'm scared of it. I don't know what you guys think about it. Let me know in the comments. It's kind of fascinating, honestly, that, that we have a $1,000 MSRP card. It is being sold. It's a Blue Eyes White Dragon. Everybody loves Blue Eyes. Everybody loves collecting, investing in Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Also, okay, not everybody, but a lot of us do. You know, it's fun. It's cool. It's exciting because it's not, you know, stocks, something you can hold, something you can enjoy, you can display all that stuff, but that I'm rambling at this point. I've enjoyed uh, following this. We're gonna see what happens in about six days at the time we re release this video. And uh, let me know, make sure you guys let me know in the comments. And if you guys made it to the end, I got a giveaway for you guys. I'm giving away a Blue Eyes White Dragon. It is not the most crazy Blue Eyes. It's not worth a thousand dollars. Okay, can you guys even see this? It is a Collector's 10 Secret Rare from CT14. I don't even remember what year that is. I think that might be 17, I don't know. But uh, I don't think it's actually 14, it's the confusing part. Just like the video, let me know in the comments what you guys think about this video, you know, what I'm talking about, and you'll be entered in that giveaway. That's it for this one. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Okay, Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs> <laughs>